Hi guys and welcome to episode 4 of Will Lem Plays through just the first rank of a bunch of custom packs in Neo Lemix. So this time I'm going to be looking at a pack which I've been really looking forward to playing. This is the TM Challenge pack uh, by Proxima. Uh, it's a remix pack of some of the original levels. Uh, the ones, specifically the ones that have all the decoration either side and, and what, what he's done is he's placed the entrance hatches and in some cases the exits in different places around the decorative terrain and made completely new levels. So yeah, I've been really looking forward to these, just my kind of levels. So yeah, let's get let's get into it. Just as complicated as it looks, I like that. I, I had a remix level um, of this same level, which I called, uh, I just called it as complicated as it looks. Um, and it was basically, I put the entrance hatch there and the exit over there and it looks like that is basically what's been done here as well except they've kept uh, he's kept the entr entrance hatch where it was originally um oh this one looks like it might be you can sort of do that and then there is the time limit but it's not too bad five minutes should be plenty really Loads of skills, so yeah, this one, this one looks like it's going to be a, an any way you want it type of level. Nice and easy. Bit of a break from the the challenges of uh, Ron Stard's pack. Mind you, there was there's apparently a level uh, in this pack that uh, that even Proxima struggled to solve when he played it a few weeks ago. So. Who knows what to think. Ah. The old turning bashers. Right. I'll release the crowd at about one and a half minutes. Fantastic opening level. Yeah, really enjoyed that one. That was cool. Smile if you love decoration. Okay, so... An error occurred whilst trying to save data. Really? Yeah. That seems a bit... Oh, an error occurred while trying to save data. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. really think about that. I just sort of did it. That wasn't the best thing I could have done there. That was. <laughs> yeah, I love I love the concepts of this pack. So you know they've basically taken these levels and, and made full use of all of the wonderful decorative terrain. Uh, on the outsides of the levels, which um, which I just think is awesome. So I've been looking forward to playing this one. But I thought, uh, you know, I wanted I wanted to save it for this uh, for this LP. Yeah, 
But yeah, these are these are definitely my kind of levels. Just loads of skills. You know, it's just a case of finding a way through all of the obstacles. I think with any way you want it levels, the challenge is making it so that they, you know, remain interesting throughout. You know, so it doesn't just feel like a trivial case of just playing your way through the level. Like, that was that was cool, I wasn't expecting that. Um, and it's just it's little things like that um, is what I'm talking about, you know. So it's not just a straightforward, of, you know, a straightforward case of bashing your way through, you know, a couple of obstacles. You've got to actually think, um, okay, if there's a, like a structure like this, you know, it's fairly complex and, and you've, you know, like that, I wasn't expecting that little gap there. And it's little, little things like that that keep levels like this interesting. Yeah, so that, bit of a build a fest at the end there, but, yeah, that's okay. It's, uh, it is, it is fun to enjoy these levels in this, uh, in this way. Yeah, great. Really enjoying this one so far. Lemming Sherbet. Right, where have they put the exit this time? Up there. Okay, is there anything else going on over here? No, okay. See, what what I'd love to do is, is remix these levels, but put the entrance hatch over here. And, um, but yeah, no, I think I like the fact that they've kept they've kept it in the original place because then you're just going, okay, where's the exit, and you're not, you know, you're not sort of worrying about where the where the hatch is as well, or whether there's another entrance hatch. Um, so yeah, that's that's good. I'm saying they because I think I remember saying that Proxima worked with someone on this pack. Um, so yeah, I'm, that's why I'm using the plug. can lose a few but I'm obviously going to try and save all of them so what I'll do is I'll uh, do the standard um, going over this way thing and start to build up from here. I'm going to try and conserve these builders though because it does seem like the kind of level where I'm going to need lots of them. I'm just going to climb out of here and then the reason I did a digger there is so that this one can build all the way up to that bridge. Um, oh yeah, I forgot about that. I need to do this as well. It would be lovely if this guy connects before he reaches it. Yes! Okay. Ah, oh, that was good. That was a good moment. Um, although I do feel like I should probably just bash straight through there. See, this is where you've got to think because they can't all climb up there. If I bash through, <coughs> then I might be able to use that staircase to get up there seems doable. Or the other alternative is to bash through here and then turn him around and mine backwards through here. Um, yeah, I'll do that. I'll do that. And then I'm going to do a miner here to, get, to make
like that. Walk up a bull. So I'll bash. Well, yeah, I can do mine. That's fine. Mine is fine. And then I'll just stop him with a builder, and then he can turn around and mine down. Time, this one can carry on. I'm enjoying this two overlapping workers thing. Uh, obviously, it's sort of like you know, it's, it's obviously just the way that I happen to be solving it. It's, it's probably not intended. Um, well, I don't know, maybe it is, but uh, it's certainly certainly fun. But I think that's another thing with, with any way you want it levels. You know, finding ways to kind of make, you know, overlapping workers intended uh, is part of the fun. I think it's time to release the crowd now, so we'll just get another builder started here and then send another. Still lemmings coming out. There we go. Should be plenty of time to walk across the route. That one was brilliant. That one was really good. Like, just all these structures just really lend themselves well to, you know, that kind of that kind of approach anyway you want it loads of skills and there's lots of you know things to get around so yeah very good turn around and despair tm challenge four 80 lemmings this time we'll try and save all of them again ah okay so gone are the uh gone are the 20 of each well i think so, uh, saving all of them probably isn't going to be possible. Uh, the exit pouch is, sorry, the exit is over there. Um, that seems a shame. Oh, I know what to do. I know what to do. This one can build so that he turns around. Oh no! Right, so I can't, I can't have that. Oh no, really? Right, okay, that's not gonna work then. So, I'm, I am gonna have to do it this way. That worked. Right, cool, okay, that, that worked. Um, and then I just need to make you a bomber. Maybe in that case make the first one that goes that way a bomber. And then we've got our work. Well, I think, I 
think I've got an idea. If I use the basher here and just get, get as much of the root completed as I can. Right. And then that guy's obviously gonna have the bomb. And then Right. Okay, I'm just I'm just gonna have to try some stuff. I suppose what I could do is keep bombing here. Oops, no, I didn't mean to bomb the builder. Bomb the builder. <laughs> there we go, that's it. That's what I meant to do. And then just keep just keep sending uh, workers out this way. I think I've got enough. Mm. Not quite. Maybe no, maybe in this instance I am gonna have to bomb the builder. But after he's completed the bridge. Bomb the second one that walks out. Oh, no, that didn't work. <sighs> okay. Basically, got to try and free up. How many am I going to need? Another one to get through that. Build, and then another two to get through that. What I need to do then is, and I do need to widen this hole a bit, so that I can do that. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that worked out okay. Quite happy with that. those ones up with a few um, builders. Oh look, okay I didn't realise that. And that's a problem as well. I've got ten builders so what I'll do is this. Right, okay, I'm, I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to go back. I didn't realize that there was more than one lemming there. So what I'm gonna do is not build at this point because this is already more than enough lemmings to complete this. So yeah, he'll turn around. This guy, I just need to stall him. Um, or stall this one. to send another worker out from here then. I'm getting quite 
blow on builders now. If I blow one of these ones up now, then that builder will carry on. And then I just need, I just need one more worker after that. to watch these uh... okay. oh no 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 <laughs> uh... there we go that's alright oh but he turned around I just need one more worker from out of here how am I gonna do that Too many. Oh, I'm so close. I'm so close to getting this. I'm so close to solving this. I just need to get one more worker out. Right, okay, I think I know how to do it. No, 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 not like that. So, how do I do this? Yeah, yeah, that's it. Then that one will walk. Oh. oh no, hang on, hang on. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's done it, I think. Done it. Well, I don't know, maybe I released them a bit too soon actually. No, I think I released them a bit too soon. So, don't release them just yet. I'll wait till this one's got a decent way over first. And then I'll maybe get one from the middle of the bunch. I also don't want him building over the exit, so I'm going to start the exit bridge from a bit further back. I should do it. Stop building, stop building, stop building. Yes! Oh, look at that as well. Exactly the amount needed. That was a tough one. That was, again, that was probably about as difficult as I enjoy. So that was, that was spot on. Uh, get a little extra help. Let's see what's different about this one. Right, the exit's up there. Okay, loads of builders, that's good. Always nice to see plenty of builders. Um, not so, quite so many destructive skills. I can lose 10. Right, my instinct is basically to bash all the way through here. Um, bash cancel, make a blocker, build. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Oh, I forgot about that. Right, I'll just, I'll just block. I'll block for now, and if, if there is a way to rescue that one, I'll try and rescue that one as well. Shh. 
should be able to bash cancel my way out of there now. Yeah, maybe, might be a bit too low. We'll see. Right, that's an issue. Um, nah, it's not actually. It's, I can just do that. But I know now that there's no way to uh, rescue that, that blocker and there's probably not going to be a way to rescue that blocker either. But we'll see. Can lose 10, so. And I spent a long time on that last level, so. Yeah, I think that that's pretty much all the destructive skills apart from diggers, which aren't really much um, use without um, without other ones as well. So. going to be a lose to this one. Cool, okay. Yeah, that was uh, that was nice and easy. It's probably about tr tricky difficulty, probably, that one. It's good. Uh, hocus Pocus. An error occurred whilst trying to save data. It's just a big inflatable globe. Right, so let's see what's going on here. Right, okay, so, right, so you've used the entire level for this one. This is gonna be fun. 15 builders. That, uh, that's probably as restrictive as it appears. No climbers as well, so I can't just climb a worker out of there. Um, what I can do though is build from here. Actually, no, I'll just use a blocker because no. there's there's not very many builders and there's a lot of stuff to get over. So I'll just do that, and then I can bash free the blocker later on, hopefully, assuming that there will be enough skills to do so. Okay. Well, fairly straightforward so far, but I can already feel the uh, the builders are running out. That's good. They can just walk, they can just walk up there and then they'll use a basher. Okay, this one, this one seems doable so far. Yeah. That that wasn't nearly as bad as I thought it would be, to be honest. Plenty of time as well, so I can just there we go. Yeah, that one was uh, a bit of a bit of a relief. I was expecting it to be a bit harder than that, but that was uh, good. These, I have to say, these are good, easy levels. Like we've had um, maybe a couple in the tricky sort of difficulty, maybe uh, maybe one or two of them I'd, I'd have put in taxing difficulty. Um, but so far they're, they're just feeling like good, solid, but easy levels. Um, and th this is exactly the kind of thing that I'm interested in, um, in, in creating myself as part of my own packs. Uh, so it's um you know it's good to it's good to play levels like this and, and and get that inspiration who are you gonna call right let's have a look right so there's the entrance hatch i don't 
think from the level preview, I don't think any of this part of the level has been used. So I suppose you couldn't use any of that because this is just a wall of steel. Wow, okay. The only destructive skill is bombers. And we've only got 10 builders. Wow, this one's going to be tough. Let's give it a go. Well, straight away I need to block there to stop the crowd. I like the concept though. I think, you know, they've kept the... Uh, the main three skills from um, calling the bomb squad. I'm just gonna see how far I can get through just bombing for now. Sorry, it stopped, uh, it stopped recording and I ran out of builders anyway, so I'm going to have to just go back and um, block here instead because I ran out of builders. In fact, right, builders are at a premium in this, so going to be important to uh, preserve as many of them as I can so I'm not going to do I'm not going to bomb through here I'm going to instead um, bomb, uh, block there so that that happens basically Now, do I'll do a zigzag staircase. I'll use use blockers and make a, a zigzag staircase. There we go. Perfect. It's just what I needed. Four. I need four builders at this end bit here. Ah. Right, is there any way I can prevent that? I need to, again, I need to time this builder so that, right, if I get one of these guys to build, then I've got loads of loose lemmings here. Thing. Oh, 
Oh no! Oh god, I really thought that I'd be able to get up there with one builder. got to get up here in five builders. That's pretty much the long and short of it. One, two, three, wait, one, two, two about there, three, four, five, that might be doable. Wait, yeah, if I start building here and then do a bit of a zigzag. So... Perfect. Not perfect. There we go, that was, that was okay, that worked out. Okay, in the end. Ideal. Although I have just realised. Oh no, it's okay because I've got block. I've got another blocker, of course. So what I can do is, when one of these lands, I'll block here, and then yeah, that's pretty much it. Might be able to do here is the old blocker trail. Oh, no, I don't think I don't think Neolemics allows you to do that. Um, that might be okay actually. No. Oh yeah, no, it is. Yes. Grand. Yeah, another really good level there. Again, probably at the top of uh, of my sort of difficulty enjoyability scale. So yeah, th this this is basically an ideal pack for me. I've, I've said that, I think, enough times now. Um, the Frantic Lemming Antic. So this is level eight. So three more to go, including this one. And yeah, uh, uh, Remix of Nightmare on Lemon Street, a level which uh, I also love to do re remixes of. Two lemmings. And it looks like plenty of skills to do this fairly easily. Climber. There's only two builders, that's the problem. And I can't obviously can't use any bombers. I'm thinking I need the builders. Don't necessarily need a builder there because I could climb, build, build, turn mine. Potentially. Or build and build from there. Well, let's just see. I think I'm going to have to use the blocker trick to uh, Turn that one around. Wait, hang on. There we go. That's basically what I wanted. It's about using these builders really carefully. I can't let the climber go back this way either. That's another, um... wait, unless I do this. I 
can't do this. Okay. Also keeps him occupied for a little while. Um, so now I can let the climber turn around now. So that makes things a little bit more. See, I'm thinking not to build over these gaps, but instead to mine backwards to allow the non-climber to get up there. But what that does mean is that I'm gonna to have to turn this guy around somehow. So let's just see if I can get close enough to that block. No, I can't. So it's looking like I'm gonna to have to I've got it. Okay. No, because he's not going to be able to climb there now. Oh no, because it, it's fine, he can bash through there. Don't destroy that one as well. Uh, but again, actually, that doesn't matter because you can just do that. There we go. Okay, so I probably overcomplicated that. That wasn't as hard as I thought it was going to be. Managed to just about get my way around that one. So yeah, cool. Eight down, two more to go. Enjoy the trip. Okay, so it's this one again, but with the exit on the other side. An error occurred whilst trying to save data. Plenty of builders, always nice to see. there so I can just bash through there. Really? So I need to be building from about there. So I'll do that. And then I think it's just a case of building over this. Hopefully. Be a little bit tricky because I don't have any more destructive skills for that. I was I was kind of hoping I'd have another destructive skill to just bash through there, but not so much. So this is going to be a bit tricky. Hang on, though. I know what to do. Plug up this gap, and then I'm not worried now. Cool. Grand. Yeah, brilliant. Fantastic level. And I like that, you know, I like that uh, they went back and used this side of the level as well. Very good. Forgive me. Okay, so this is the last level of the challenge now. So 
and it looks like it's a remix of Save Me, so and they've called it Forgive Me instead. So yeah, cool. Let's uh, see what we have to do here. There's only 15 builders, so already that's pretty shocking. I've got to get all the way over here. Oh my god. Oh look at and there's hardly any destructive skills as well. This might be the, the challenge in TM challenge. Obviously, you're not going to build out that way because it takes more than 15 builders to to do that, I think. So it's going to be, it is going to be getting up here as you normally would. Then build over there, bash through there, dig, build. Um, that's just walkable. Maybe, maybe drop down there, build up there. Bash, that's the two bashes gone. So it's not going to be that. How on earth do you do this? Build, bash, and then that's the two bashes gone. Right, let's let's reverse engineer. So they can either come through here, having walked up there, across there. But again, that's two bashes. Um, that's one way it could be done, though. But that is that is t um, two bashes. Unless maybe, hang on, there's, there are diggers, so maybe you can dig. Cancel, dig, cancel. But I don't think two diggers would get through there. So, okay, let's try this way then. So, bash through here. But then you've still got to get through there. So, either way, you've got at least two things to get through. And you definitely need a basher for that. But it looks impossible. But... I can't see Proxima uploading an impossible level, so it has to be possible. But how is the question? I think I've got an idea. <clears throat> I think that if I if we can find a way <clears throat> to get through one of the obstacles just using diggers, then then that's it basically. But so I'm just gonna try it. I do have an idea. It would be a shame not to complete this level because you know I've completed every other level in the pack, so it would be good to get this one done as well. Okay. I think I've got an idea. Let's do this thing. What's happened here? All right. So I think usual drill, just to get the uh, lens up to <clears throat> this bit here. I don't think I have to be too um, too conservative with the builders at this point. I'm trying this idea out. I can lose quite a lot of lemmings, I obviously don't want to. Um, so I'll try and save as many as possible. Right, and then what one is loose lemmings walking over the top here. So the way to do that is let all of these <clears throat> bunched up ones go past and then start building. And then it'll be, oh, that, what? Right, so now I'm gonna have to do 
the safety bridge a bit further forward. Five builders left is not not brilliant, but I haven't really got much choice at this point. So the idea I've got is I'm going to try and get through this just using diggers. It is possible to get down there, and I can afford to lose. get two bunched up lemmings here to where he is and then block I might get one like right in there who can then dig that'll probably free the blocker as well and then yeah I'm gonna try that yes here we go just walking back past him because it's not the trigger isn't close enough <sighs> okay what if I do this what if I do this I'll get him to do that and I'll turn him round and then I can sacrifice this one maybe I'll just make him block for now that gets all the rest of them over to here. Um, I've only got one builder left though. Ideally you want one, two, three, bash, four, bash. You want four builders at that point. Maybe I can, I can I've got one. I can uh, get another one by not doing this safety bridge and I might be able to get up here in three. So that's that's three. Um, right, so start again. So just three bridges there. One to get over the blocker. And then I'll try and get up there in three as well. I'm not even sure if it's possible, but at this point it's going to have to. That's nowhere near it. So yeah, I'm gonna need four at the start there. I'm just seeing if my plan will work for now. That's all I'm doing. Yeah, that definitely needs three. That definitely needs three. And then um, the basher to get through there. Build up to there. And then bash again. Yeah, so you need four and you need the two bashes for that bit. I mean, that just doesn't seem possible. Oh, I've been at this for 20 minutes now. I'm going to have to call it. It's a shame, really, because I really enjoyed this pack. But this one's just a little bit... 
that a little bit too out there. Yeah, sorry guys, I'm gonna have to call this one about it for quite some time. But I will come back to it at some point and hopefully do it. Maybe, maybe uh, Proxima can give me some tips on how to get that one solved. And um, yeah, I'll uh, if if I do manage to come up with a solution, I will definitely uh, film it and uh, and post it, even if it means posting it as a separate video. So yeah, cool. So if you have been, thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.